The chances are you are reading these words on a smartphone or computer screen. For around the last 10 years, these types of screens have been based on a display technology composed of so-called thin film transistors. These are inorganic transistors which require very little power, and they have proven themselves very capable given their widespread adoption. But they have some limits which researchers have been busy trying to overcome. We explore new ways to improve upon thin film transistors, such as new designs or new methods of manufacture, said Gyo Kitahara, a Ph.D. student from the Department of Applied Physics. Organic thin film transistors, for example, have a bright future in LCD screen devices. Compared to the inorganic kind currently used, we expect the organic kind to be useful in low-cost, large-area, lightweight and wearable electronic products, especially by using printing-based production technologies. The idea of organic thin film transistors itself is not new, but the ability t. This means ordinarily the surface would repel the materials required to print the structure of the transistor, which seems counterintuitive as to why such a surface would be useful at all. But lyophobic surfaces are responsible for creating transistor structures that are finely tuned for high performance. So how did the researchers overcome their repellent nature? We made use of a fluidic property you probably see every time you wash your hands with soap, said Kitahara. Soap bubbles can hold a shape by lowering the surface tension of liquid. With a proliferation of large, flexible or wearable devices, Hasegawa's team dreams of seeing a convergence between the real world and virtual world in ways we've never seen before. Note. Content may be edited for style and length. Please support my channel to grow by pressing subscribe button and the bell icon. We will notify you technological news. Thank you.